Sometimes you need them gold blooms. Sometimes you gotta gold bloom. Mm -hmm. Sometimes. Anyway. All right. we are now we're back on the right things. Two to one. Rando down. high fives versus Detroit down. Smash. Rando high fives up two one in the set. I think this matchup is for Zangief. I think Nash is good. Y'all don't realize. Nash is good. I mean, this matchup definitely. I don't know how I feel about season five Nash, but this matchup has has always been bad for Geef. But Nash got better this particular season. Yeah, I know Bonchan's talking a big Nash game right now. At least was last week. Not sure it still is. Okay, gets a jump in. Push into the corner. Question. Confirms. Do... Hold on. Does Nash's... Hear the dogs barking. Soon they say what up. Haters play the front, play the back, and candy cat parking. Dude, that video is so good. Ooh, okay, that there's no way that wasn't. I think that was supposed to be a fireball. Uh, no, this uh. Hmm. The question I wanted to ask was, if Nash goes. If, if Nash goes V-Skill 2, does he still have access to his target combo that includes V-Skill 1? That's a great question. I would guess no. I don't I, I don't know. I would guess no, but I don't know the answer to that. Okay. Nash mains Neon if you're in the chat. But no. This is literally oh sick. Literally the fr this is great. I love that shit. That's fantastic. Uh, literally the first time I've thought about Street Fighter in three weeks. <laughs> this is this is actually awesome. <laughs> that sounds amazing. Actually, it's like complete mental break. Oh my god, it was fantastic. Uh, yeah, Neon plays Nash. Hell yeah. That wasn't a good reversal. Don't I'm gonna go take a look at my dog and see why they're barking. I'll be back. Let them know. Same as you're walking. Dogs are barking. Oh, catch that back dash, motherfucker. That you're done, sick. Zach. You're done. You're done, son. Look at that. One touch away. There it is. <laughs> Give it to me. I love it. Detroit Smash. No, thank you. Cannot keep away this Zangief. A lot of Zang. In all fairness. A lot of cool 69 emote. I like that a lot. McBosco. That's cool. BFF69. I don't know why that's inappropriate. However, I dig it. But what I will say is that a lot of Zangiefs learned that matchup in Season 1 because it was... It was bad. It wasn't good. But I don't think it got better. It, like, it got worse. This is not a good situation. Anyway, we're going to move on up to the winner side with the Deluxe Apartment in winner side. So we got Spezbois and Rush. Hey, look at that. Look at that. I'm going to kick uh, Tom for the time being. I'll tell him to rejoin once he takes care of the pepperonis, but we'll get there. It's the boss. Welcome to the chat, my friend. Hey, folks. If this is your first time joining us, this is the R Street Fighter Online Local. I'm your host, Joe Monday. I've got Tom on the mic. He's taking care of dogs right now. It's all good. You know, sometimes dogs bark. That's cool. Uh, sometimes they get mad. It's all right. They protect. Sometimes dogs protect. They are, they are doing the protect, and they will not stop. I did a I did a kick on you, Tom. It's all good. I got the I got the lobby. Fair enough. Uh, but you got cool dogs, which is all right. Ooh, forcing Space Bois to go to the Sakura. Cause we've seen Space Bois go with Edmund Honda this whole time. I didn't realize right now until this second that V Skill Two is called Ed. Indignant Thunder. 
V-Skill 2 is called Indignant Thunder. That's so fucking good. Hold on. Indignant. This indignant motherfucker right here. Oh, that's a buff right there that the uh, crouching, uh, that the uh, upwards fireball reaches from range. Yo, get fucked! The recovery on that Hadouken, thank you very much. Spezbois! Master Sakura! Not quite Ultimate Grandmaster, but we are, we are Master Sakura! Oh, hold on, I gotta reset these scores. And change what the thing says to you guys. There we go. Yo, space blah. Back to the side. That overhead will hit, and it will... Nah, that happened about exactly as I thought it would. But it happened so fast I couldn't spawn it. Yo! I respect the, the up fire ball. In that situation. Expecting these. I would expect these in that situation. Not right not from rushdown though. A lesser Yuri and I would expect these. But not from rushdown. From like an O crippler. Or like a uh Final Round. It's another Yurian who opens this tournament. Like a man mandrake. I might expect an ease at that time. Not from a rushdown. Not from profit. I, uh, maybe profit. Maybe profit. Yeah. Here we go. Look at that corner control. Nah, out of there. EX shoulder. Get fucked. Check this. Yo. That, that DP was <clears throat> clutch. Indeed. I don't know exactly where problem is from. I should know that. Or like in the northeast, right? Sakura like, wins. <clears throat> New Yorkish, or um, like McBosco said, or even maybe I want to say like New England area, but I'm probably way off. Is Prophet? Hmm. Round one. Hold the fucking fight. fight. Connecticut. <clears throat> That's what his Twitter says. Okay. All right. All right. Right on. No, I'm getting, I get Prophet and, uh, Oh Crippler confused. I got them confused, man, because I was like, is he from the Toronto area? But that's Oh Crippler. Oh, oh let's low 40 at go. Good patience from Rushdown. Yeah, what are they playing? Penguin, you're not wrong. All the Urians, they, they run together. You Except might be dead. Except for this pink baby right here. This pink mm -hmm. suited baby. This pink suited child. Rush down. <laughs> Raw shoulder. And it connects. Are you kidding me? Easy. As Space Bois says. You got the same tears. I do like Sa. <gasps> I mm. forgot what Sakura's V skill 2 was until right now. <laughs> and. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. And as you clearly saw, oh, except for that, as a damage extender, didn't seem super useful in that pressure. It's not. I don't know that it's even as good as Ken's, like, run stop stuff. Which isn't that great either. Oh, oh no, drops! That's a dead. That's a dead Sakura. Uh, <gasps> why? She's still. Uh, okay. Uh, whatever. Eh, yeah, whatever. Automatic calling the all Yurians are coal Yurian rollers. Wins. They're rolling coal. I got well, as someone who parks in a parking lot with a lot of people who are rolling coal, the earth is doomed. Yeah, we're all doomed. 
what is goal rolling mean for those of us Round that one. don't hang out with the Oh, it's when you make your your truck uh spend like a whole fucking lot of exhaust oh uh, okay yeah like out in the top half and it's just like and i don't know why right so like as an engineer i'm like yo if you see smoke or noise that's engineering uh that's failure because you're wasting energy through smoke and noise versus raw output of that was a sick like little side switch on that feature. side switch rush down was wise to that shit you done uh, oh now yeah mm. <gasps> okay now you done I just, I rush down keep uh, keep me on my toes I'm like oh maybe they come back oh nope maybe they come back <gasps> nope but yeah like smoke and noise is an expanding of well, what if you're designing for smoke? Oh, if you're designing a smoke and noise machine. To that, I will say, uh, if you had that during one of... I saw... Mm, <laughs> Alright, so regardless of what's happening with fighting games right now, I have to talk about an art exhibit I once saw. So, <laughs> years ago, maybe a decade ago, I once saw an art exhibit that was called Z. It was just called Z. I saw it during an art crawl. It was at the end of the art crawl, and they That's were a good like, place for that, was just, "That was a sick deal." That was really and they cool. they were like letting people in through a line, and they were letting in like a certain amount of people at a time because you don't have so many people in this room at a time. And I was like, "All right, whatever." I was sick with punish. Mm -hmm. uh, however, we got in like one of the last shows they did, and. As soon as you walk in, so much fog. Like, I couldn't tell you how many fog machines there were because you couldn't see your hand. If you put it on your nose, you couldn't see your fingers. That's how much fog there was. Right? So, when you walk in the exhibit, there was like a certain amount of rumble. And it's like a little bit of like a low rumble. And you're like, what's going on? I don't understand this low rumble. I can't see my hand. And then there's like this little blinking light from a space that you literally can't tell where it's coming from because you can't see in front of yourself. It's just that thick of a fog. And so the rumble's getting louder. And the lights are getting more intense as the rumble's getting louder. And soon enough, the rumble is getting loud enough and the lights are getting intense enough that... You know when, and you folks, you can try this at home, uh, like press on your eyeballs a little bit and like you'll start to see like colors like Round pop one. in and flash a little bit. Fight. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Just for like a second. Press on your eyeballs for like a second. And there's like colors and shit. That's what it looked like with your eyes open. It was fucking wild. Never like experienced anything like this in my whole life. It was like, and it was that for about 15-ish minutes of like the rumble getting louder and the lights getting brighter, and it was like coming at you in a direction where you couldn't tell the direction because the fog was so thick. And it, oh man, it was just man, it was fucking wild. And I'm pretty sure you can't like experience that particular art exhibit experience anymore. I've tried to look it up, but it's fucking impossible with a name like Z, which is unsearchable, honestly, in modern terms, but anyway. Right. In this economy especially, like, you I've know, I'm going to be able to pay for a yeah. search term. You oh, can't. anyway, let's get... I'm sorry for that long soliloquy. I did... It was... That shit was fucking wild. I'm sorry to, like, take a huge aside like that, but, like... I think about that shit, like, pretty often. And it's Space Boy! Yeah, if- Grand Finals, ooh. are you kidding me? We got a soccer in Grand Finals, or a Honda. Oh, fuck this, fuck this Arian. Right up the bunghole, that's right. Don't you forget it. Big Z's in the chat. Show me them Z's in the chat. Absolutely. 
Rushdown, the guy that plays online Urian, hating on online Sakura. Get wrecked. Get blessed. Alright. Let's give some boots. I got Tim's for y'all. Let's head on down to Loser's Semifinals. Which is, let me take a look real quick and try and figure out who that is. Profit and random high fives. Cool. What the? Excuse? <laughs> Fuck out of here. <laughs> Joe might not have the rage quit combo, but he's got the boot combo. I'm Unlocked. pretty good at that. All day. All day. All right, got that rando high fives in there, and then I need who else? Uh, profit. Okay. Wait, there he was. Got him. Got him. Found him. Anyway, folks. So uh, try Profit's not to do been things. rocking, been rocking Honda see. the whole time. So we think we're gonna see Geef Honda. I'm gonna ignore what you just said and go on to something that I just remembered. Anyway, my. I got a work email this morning that I think that my safety people at where I work was like, I think they just figured out what CBD oil is. Oh. And they were like, company-wide email, hey, if you consume CBD 